Hey guys, welcome back. We are going into The House. This is another game that I found on Itch.io. It's been out for a while now, but it just kind of caught my attention in my, uh, my little page. But yeah, we're going to go out with some friends in an abandoned house in the middle of nowhere. So we'll see how this goes. Oh, okay. Huh. The tragic events of that day still intrigue not only FBI but the whole country, and it has become one of the most bizarre cases that has ever been solved. There are reports of people who say they hear the deafening screams just by going near that place. Okay. Colorado, 1979. I like your wheels. <laughs> Amanda, why does your family have a house here in the middle of nowhere, Scott? I think it belonged to my great-grandfather. The oldest man bought this house at auction a long time ago. My family never managed to sell it, and it was abandoned for some years. So now it's mine. Of course they didn't. This house is falling apart. How old is it? Relax, bro. The furniture is almost new. I can't believe I left my aerobics class for this. Guys, nobody in my family wants this house. We can do whatever we want here. Nobody will care if we break something, have a party, or even demolish this crap. Okay, okay. You've already convinced me. Ashley and I will go in and have a look around the house. I'm excited for today. I've always had a crush on Scott. He just recently broke up with my friend Sarah, so I don't want to be a douchebag. I only came on this trip because Ashley didn't want to be the one, only girl here. I better hurry up and get my backpack out of the van. I don't know how I feel about that. You really probably shouldn't try to get up on your uh, friend's ex. I'll check the tires before I park the van near the house. You can go ahead. Here's your backpack. You can put it in the bedroom on the second floor. Okay, thanks. Huh. Alright, so I'm assuming it's this way. Because I see a chimney in the fog. Hmm? Title car! <laughs> the House by Spring Rabbit. Okay. Nice little uh, area. We got a shed. I almost had a pile of dirt. I think that's a piece of equipment. Let's just go in the house, see what's going on. And if you hear me talking in a very loving way, my dog is in the basement. I love that little guy. March 6th of 1944. Two days ago, the 17 year old body. <laughs> Two days ago, the 17 year old boy Noah Campbell was hunting with his father when he disappeared in the woods. Today, the police found the boy's blood and a piece of his pants in an unknown or an area known to inhabit mountain lions. The boy's body was not found at the scene, indicating that the boy managed to escape the attack. My reading comprehension skills are just like on point right now. I promise. Oh, there's Brian. Scott's with the van. Alright. So. Fine, whatever. So I'm assuming it's this door. Second bedroom. Ashley. Hey, put your stuff on the other bed. I'm going downstairs to drink some water. Oh, wow. <laughs> Got a little too close. Now I can meet everyone downstairs. Just gingerly putting- wow, she booked it. She did not want anything to do with me. Are we really friends? Alright. So she was going to get water. Boop -a boop This damn tap doesn't work. Can you go outside and ask Scott to fix this crap? <sighs> Why don't you go ask him? You're the one that wants the water. I don't. All right, so, ooh, hey boys. There seems to be some problem with the plumbing in the house. The taps don't work. Brian told me we're going to take the town. We're going to the next town to buy some drinks and something to eat. I will call plumber as soon as I get there. 
We have to shake this place up. Did you buy bring a radio? This is a very old house. There must be a radio somewhere. Can you and Ashley look for it while we do the shopping? Sure. Not what I want to do. Yeah, it's a piece of equipment. Alright, whatever. What's around here? Ooh, a bucket. I don't need a bucket. I, who doesn't need a bucket? And it looks like a good bucket. You always need a good... That's one thing you need in your house. A good solid bucket. Let's go this way. Okay, so we can get in. Where the hell is Ashley? Probably in the kitchen where I left her. Calm down. What is with these people? It's locked. So you can get in. Oh, well, she's not in the kitchen where I left her. <laughs> I would help you, but I don't want to wear out my fingernails messing around in this old house. In this house. You can put the radio on the table if you find it. I think my brain is getting ahead of just reading what's on the screen. Anyway, let's go up here. I couldn't. I never said I couldn't. I can get in. Ooh, what's a key? And a note. Honorable discharge. Henry F. Smith. Honorably discharged. Okay. So I'm wondering if that's um, Scott's. What do you say? Great grandfather. Oh, I heard the key. Oh, 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 nice. Found the radio. What's that? Here is the radio. I better take this downstairs. Maybe this will be useful. Uh-huh. I don't like where this is going. Why would you just grab somebody's flashlight and just be like, oh, <laughs> mine now? I don't go into a house assuming that something horrible is going to happen to me. Okay. Bam. We are ready to jam. It's not working. It seems that the batteries are missing. And you're going to be useless to me, so let me do it myself. Um. I think. What's this? Ah, the basement. Okay, whatever. Da 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 da. Basements and bathrooms usually in horror games are usually kind of just a no-go zone for me. A note. Rebuilding brain tissue seemed crazy at first. I've worked with this all my life and now they discard me like an animal. I serve so much time, so many secrets, so many de so many deaths. They forced me to sign a confidentiality document so all my work, my life story, stayed in the army. That turned. <laughs> oh no. Cool. Batteries. I saw... I think this is... Yeah. I can't get in. Okay. Fair. It's a spooky basement. I don't like... Let's get out of here. Ooh. Excuse me? I am a little dizzy. I must be dehydrated. How do you... Did the house go dark or did your vision go dark? Because how do you equate that? If the house went dark, I wouldn't go, Oh man, I must be dizzy. It's working now. I'll ask Ashley if she brought a water bottle. She's not helpful. What? <laughs> She's not even helpful. Why would I ask her anything? Did you bring a water bottle? No, I wouldn't have thought that this dump wouldn't have water. I'm not feeling very well. I'm a little dizzy. If an O'Brien's got well, they won't bring anything non-alcoholic to drink. There is a well next to the house. Go there to drink water. If you get worse, we can go to the hospital. I'm sure it's nothing serious. I'm going there. <sighs> uh-huh. So I have well water, and well water is delicious, okay? But there's something about coming out here to drink well water. And I'm pretty sure some of you were like, oh no, the bucket's not... Why would you need ever need a good bucket? Why does she run like this? I love it. She's just hoofing this bucket around. But yeah, this is why you need a good bucket in your life. Good, sturdy wood bucket. Okay, she said next to the house, so... They need a path here. What? Oh, there we go. Bucket in water. It's a black water. 
Bye, Bucket. Oh. It seems that the bucket came with the key. It didn't come with the key. I'm pretty sure you just fished it out of the well somehow. Alright, let's get- let's just hoof it back. Did you drink? I- You see that guy standing there, right? Right there. Right. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Absolutely not. Oh, and there's music kicking in. Absolutely not. Let's- no. Mm -mm. Don't like it. Where's the boys? I want to go home. I'm done. Done with this place. Alright. Why are we having the party just back here? Can we do it in the living room with the couch? I found this key in the well. Try to look for some... Try to look for where it fits. Maybe you will find something valuable in this house. What, are we gonna steal from Scott? I mean... Can't go through there. I mean, he did make mention that basically his family didn't care. I'm in that room, that room. This be the only room. By deduction, I haven't been in this room. Oh, a window. <laughs> this place is empty. I expected something more interesting. He told you there wasn't anything here. I think I just got honked at. Oh, the boys are back. We're back. Finally, you were here. What took you so long? We had some unforeseen problems. I had to call the plumber who can only come tomorrow morning. We bought the drinks. Did you find the radio? Yes, it was in one of the rooms on the second floor. Right. What are we waiting for? Let's party. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on. I don't feel like this is... Okay. You know what? This is a chill party. This music is cool. Okay. Do you like my dance moves? Yes. Yes, I do. I'm impressed. What are you waiting for? Come dance with us. Maybe later. What am I waiting for? I mean, they're kind of weird little losers, but we can still party, right? Um, let's go... let's... There wasn't anything in the basement. Okay. Did I go through all the floors up here? Or, I'm sorry, all the rooms. Ooh, there's one I didn't go in. It's locked. No, that just means that that's, that's the bad room. Um... My bag... Let's go... I think this was the last one we opened. I don't think that hole was there when I came up here. Sure, why not? You know what? <sighs> I didn't like that. That was creepy. Oh, that's that old... Uh, like Frosted Flakes commercial or something. After a while, a huge emptiness and depression overwhelmed me. I was lost, but it seemed that God guided him for my purpose. Can I turn this off? Doesn't seem like it, so I apologize. For a while, I was confused. He knocked on my door. His leg was ble bleeding profusely. I thought of bandaging it, but I felt that this visit was not a mere coincidence. I started cutting his tendons. Poor boy. He was screaming without knowing the greatness of his existence. I was so euphoric that slowly his heart stopped, but this event cleared my mind. Now I knew what I had to be done. God guided him to me. I could not interfere with his destiny. Oh no. I don't- that's so unsettling. Is that a weapon I can take? The test with the last corpse was almost a success, but it seems that the body didn't last more than 30 seconds. Sheriff Campbell always hated me. He was sure that I was involved in the disappearance of that damned boy who was his nephew, which didn't help much. 
They went through my house and found some experiments with rats in the basement, which was enough to destroy all my work. All my progress has now been absolved by the foundation of the house. It's just a matter of time for me to reach perfection. I need to get the hell out of here. This is... Oh, cool. So does Scott know the weirdness of this place? We'll build a fire outside. I'll wait for you there. Scott, in a perfect world, I'd have throat punched you. Oh my god. Let's go outside. We have a bonfire. Oof. Sarah needs to. Or, I'm not Sarah. Amanda? Girl, you need to learn how to throw hands. I found a strange room in the basement with some sinister notes. I don't know if I will have the courage to sleep in this house. No one has lived in this house for decades. If the first owner was a dangerous person, he must be in diapers or has already kicked the bucket. I'm not sure about this. No imbecile is going to come walk into this house in the middle of nowhere because his bloodlust. This only happens in the movies. Maybe in Los Angeles. Try to relax a little bit. You must be right. Crush or not, I'm going to the next town. Don't you think you've had too much to drink? I haven't even finished my first beer yet. This is the tenth time you've said this, and they are always holding a different can. And you are always holding a different can. My apologies for, like, this lack of reading. Whatever. Scott, my bro- Er, your parents are so cool to give you a house. To be honest, my parents did not give me this house. You damn liar. They're cheapskates. They don't even know we came here. <laughs> cool, you're the man, Scott. Damn it, Scott. Are you serious? I didn't lie when I said that this house was abandoned. My parents do not care. Just relax. The only thing we have to worry about is the eye collector maniac. While brutally murdering his victims, he liked to gouge out their eyes while they were still alive to keep as a souvenir. I heard his favorite victims were women. Besides, this house was the place where he made his last killing. I've never heard about this. You're making it up. It was a long time ago. Of course you've never heard of it. You told me it was not dangerous here. I was just trying to calm you down. Shut up, Scott. I need to take my allergy medications. I'm going in. Me too. I'm tired of being around these assholes. Come on, I'm just kidding. Oh, she... She just... Audi 5000. Alright, let's... Let's get out of here, too. I'm done with these guys. They're douches. Telling me not to... What? I hope that was like a tree branch or something. Alright, to my room. To take my allergy meds. She's not in here. I thought she wanted to come up and get away. Well, she could be somewhere else in the house. I guess it's not important. Alright. So now what? Um. Hmm, I don't like this. Ew. <gasps> Good scream. I like it. <laughs> Holy shit, this medication makes me a little sleepy. What time is it? Where's Ashley? That is your first inclination is just to go, man. Meds make me sleepy. Sounds like someone's screaming in the basement. <sighs> Alright. I don't want to do it, but... Turn my light on. This basement's very central to this, uh... Stuff here. There's no one here. Oh! Ew! Oh my god, what the F is happening here? Uh, your friend has been strung up like a damn Christmas light. Nope. 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 The boys are probably dead. It's locked. I need to find another way out. It's locked. I need to find- <gasps> Whoa! <coughs> Stay away from me. <laughs> oh, you dick. Scott, are you the manic eye collector? What? No, that doesn't even exist. I was just making fun of you. 
My great-grandfather died of a heart attack just before he moved into this house. I don't even know who the previous owner was. Ashley ran out of the base. Ashley ran out to the basement. I thought you would be braver. Are you freaking kidding me? I saw her freaking body in the basement, Scott. Are you trying to scare me too? I'm serious. Shit, she might have tripped on the stairs. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what I meant. Her body was on the freaking ceiling. What? You were trying to play a trick on me. I'm freaking serious. What's your problem? Okay, let's check it out. I don't want to go anywhere with this douchebag. Yep, nope, nope, nope. I don't need friends. I don't need friends. I'm going for it. Because why not? Oh, oh my god, it's an eye. What the F is that? Brian? What has this thing done to you? Complete. The hell are you? A freaking parasite? No. I'm more. I need to get out of this place now. Oh, there's eyes everywhere. Okay, bye, Brian. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, not at all. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. Jump out? Yes, please. Why are you asking if I want- Yes, I- Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, this poor girl. Okay, let's just- Let's just go. Mm hmm? Holy effing Jesus. What? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nope. 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 Just run. Just run. Just- Who is this? Plumbing. This is the plumber. Van. Okay, cool. He saved me. Right? <laughs> oh, no. That was a cool little quickie of a little horror. I liked it. It's kind of funny that... So... Scott was the one by the well when I was coming back around, so he was the creeper by the well. So there wasn't really a killer, I'm assuming. It was just the house consumes people. I don't know about that one. That's different. A little bit of a different ball game for me. I like it though. That was fun. Low potty low poly male. I'm not exactly sure what my problem is with reading, because apparently tonight I can't. <laughs> uh, spring rabbit. I'll have to check more of their stuff out because this was kind of fun. This was kind of cool. I like it. Got some more? Ooh. On a Friday morning, Mark Williams, a 37-year-old plumber, was on a call to fix the plumbing in a house far from town. His service van was found several miles away from the scene, and according to the investigation, it had probably collided with a truck. Mark Williams was never found. I'm sorry, excuse you? What do you mean it collided with another truck? Did the... It has been more than 20 years since the disappearance of Scott Thomas, Ashley Rivera, Brian Jones, and Amanda Martinez. According to information provided by a shopkeeper and other witnesses in the nearby town, the youngsters were spending the weekend in a nearby house. It's been 20 years. Okay. That's a little... That's different. In a statement, the parents of the young Scott Thomas, one of the missing, reported that they owned a house near the site, but it had been demolished years ago. The documents in the police investigation at the site confirmed this. So wait, the house we went into technically didn't even exist? So the original house had been demolished? So it's just like a monster house. It was a parasite. Well, during the... During the investigation, the police found a homemade mask and a bloody knife near the rubble in the old house. The blood on the knife was Scott Thompson's. 
Everything points to a serial killer, but even after years of searching, the sus suspect has never been found. That was the mask that Scott was wearing. And the knife has his blood on huh. Hmm. Wait a minute. Even after years of investigation, the only concrete evidence that the police could find was that at some point there was the house. But that was the... That was the mask that Scott was wearing. So wait, when he was pulled in the basement, did something just use the knife and got him? Very interesting turn of events on that one. Okay, so that was the house. I liked it. That was a lot of fun. I like the twist at the end. Basically, it seems like the house was more than just the parasite, but it was kind of interesting that the house had been torn down and then there was this house. That was really cool. I liked it. Anyway, it was a really short and sweet game. I suggest you give it a try if you want. Um, I want to check out more of the maker's other, or the developer's other games and see what they have in store as well. But if you made it this far, thank you so much for hanging out with me. If you're, you know, a returning sub, I appreciate all of your support and I enjoy having you here. And if you are new to my channel, why don't you take a chance and sub? It would be nice to see you again. Leave a comment down below how you felt about this game. Maybe give this video a thumbs up. And as always, I love you guys. You mean the world to me. Please take care of yourselves and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.